back through. Well, all we missed were two open bathrooms. But hey, we got some squat toilets and your woman crying, so whatever. I mean, it wasn't really important, but whatever. Out. Open these doors to see what all there is to see. Now we can follow the pathway. Because my completion itself just wants to look inside toilets. There you go. Perfect reasoning on my behalf. Down the stairs we go. We're actually going to board the train? Seems like it. Not that train car, though. You? Oh, really? I guess we can just kind of get through there. That was legitimately kind of creepy scene, that old man. I'll check the door that he came from first. Of course, it's locked. Okay, let's board the train. Chugga chugga choo choo. These outcomes don't really surprise me. I can hear the police, Chief Ghost. I don't like how it sounds like he's crawling up to me. I'll just move on ahead. There's the way out. Well, that could be open. I'm gonna check over here first. Being locked doesn't really surprise me. Back to the other side, because we got a scratching sound coming from here. Or some sound, really, I don't know. Oh, the door on its hinges. I'll check it out. Of course it's open. Ah, there's handprints here. Nothing else I see, so obviously I'm going to poke the handprints. Back to prison. We can make that disappear immediately, but that's what we should. Found you. Uh oh. Oh, 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 oh. Let's get back out. Try to make my way safely, sir. Don't bother me, please. Both these being locked also don't surprise me. Now he's starting to follow us there as well. Well, I guess I'll further travel. I think I need to go upstairs, but first I'll check this door. Oh, this door actually open. Maybe I was supposed to go here. Tom? No, it can't be. Occurrence, I know. There's probably some clue here, though. I was trying to look around with my left eye, but I didn't see anything immediately, which means it's probably over this way. Through this door. Uh -oh. Yeah, you didn't even look behind you. I kind of figured he was going to start chasing you. Let's open the door. I'll check over here. The book. Is this what we needed? Let's take a look. Is this Professor Oyama's memo? 
Going to Hotel Quint to inquire about the Cade Hotel's present state. I expect to be back late, so I'll run a room. When people are killed by the game's curse, where do their souls go? My curiosity is undying. If it's possible, I want to find this out firsthand. This is Professor Oyama's memo. There's no mistaking it. I'm not surprised by this outcome either. did you come here? What did you obtain? You'll die, too, without accomplishing anything. What was that? I guess that was the end of the subway chapter. Five days left. Uh-huh. Sure. I'm gonna check out the hotel now. I'm doing the first save file. Yes. Game saved. Back to university. I wonder how the scene will change because we went to different places. Let's see how it does. As far as I can determine from the notebook, Rai Rai retrieved from the subway in the memo. Keith brought uh, back from uh, was brought back from the remains of Oyoma's home. Oyoma dove very deeply into this subject. By the way, while you two were out, I received an email from Oyama. What? All it said was, don't get involved with the game. You'll invite an unwanted demise. Most of this custom seems the same right now. Oyama is alive? It's natural to think that way. It's as if he can sense our actions. And now the memoriams Oyama left behind. Even now, he's involved with the curse game, there's no doubt about it. I wonder if Professor Oyama's trying to use the curse game for his own purposes. Going by the notebook then, the memo, he seemed to have an attachment to the curse game. And I got the impression that he cared more about what he wanted to learn than he did about people dying. He certainly was the type to immerse himself in research to the point that he became blind to what went on around him in order to perfect his theories. Oyama transmitted himself into the cursed game? No way. But now we know we're dealing with a living person. We should know where he is. Indeed. According to the information you both retrieved, one year ago Oyama visited the karaoke club and hotel. In that case, karaoke club Itoya requires investigation. We might be able to find out so this is basically the same as before besides the very beginning. I think we should check out Hotel Quiet. Professor Oyama's name was Rachel Hotel. Rachel employee knew what was going on there at the time. It's probably still around. Where will you go? We're gonna go to Hotel Quint. Let's go. Hotel Quint time. Hotel Quint, August 29th at 600 hours. It's quiet. Guess I'll go check the front desk. Alright, that's how it's best to enjoy a good old hotel outing. Sorry, glancing around. This is obviously going to be locked, as it always is. I came all the way here for a reason. I have to take a look around. First one, the door behind us was just locked or something in this game. Let's check the outside area regardless. Oh, already gained an email. Let's go check it out. Called the, let's see, Keith. Called the hotel. Professor Oyama definitely was there. I said you were looking for your missing brother, so try to act the part. The person at the hotel sounded like a young girl. Ask her about the hotel register. P.S. You can leave if you get scared. Oh my. Check out the TV and meanwhile, anything else might be of note. Is this the hotel register? It's from a year ago. Room 704. Then, and we get something in our town TS. Or excuse me, Blimpendo PS or TS there.
It's locked. Not very surprising, all things considered. No humans, uh, no non-humans allowed. So, humans allowed? But no non-humans? Uh... Uh, picked up faceless right arm. There's also something back here, obviously. I'm the manager of this inn. I've gotten some strange customers recently. These strange customers order nothing but raw meat. They feed my entire stock. Several of my customers suddenly disappeared. Only their clothes were left. Behind. I've seen them. They're not human. They're... Demons in disguise. Their eyes are terrifying. Now they're after me, but I can't escape. I won't let them eat me. I found a place to hide before they could devour me. I'll entrust you with the key to the secret passage. Brave reader, please rescue me. Picked up hidden stairs key. Okay, Alright, well we got the secret stairs key, I guess. Let's hope this goes okay. Can I just leave? It's locked. I guess I'm not really surprised. It's gone through. Here goes the stairway. Of course we just heard a door unlock. What the? I heard a sound from deeper inside. Probably exactly what we think it is. Sure, I'll investigate a bit more here. No doors over there, doesn't seem like it, so let's turn ourselves around. There's no power. We'll be taking the secret stairway key, apparently, which goes right over here. It's a nice hotel. By nice, I mean it's nicer than everything else in the game so far. It's probably not gonna last for long. Sounds coming from that. Well, there's two doors. I'll try the closer ones. That one's probably locked. Or maybe that's that stuff over there. Yep, that one's locked. There's handprints on the wall over there. Actually, let me jump. I'll touch this stuff here. Key here. There's something written on this key. Elevator power. Key? I should be able to use this to key to activate the elevator. I guess I was trying to point out the item I else. Alright, well if we got the elevator power key, that obviously goes back here. So I guess these are the hidden stairs, quote unquote. It's working! Now I can use the elevator. Well, here we go. Bring the old thing. Now we gotta pick a floor. Huh? The elevator's moving on its own? Maybe the key's programmed to do that. Well, let's kick into this. There goes a ghost. Only seeable with her left eye. My left eye? The vision didn't get messed up this time, so that means it's a nice ghost. Well, let's see what we can see. I'll try this door first. Yep, locked like expected. Which means further this way. 601. We need to go to room 702 or something, I think. Let's look around. Ah, someone decided to knock over the lamp. How rude. And further back here. Hotel Quint Bookmark. I don't think this is of any use to me. I'll tuck one bookmark. I was looking at the notepad now, but sure. Guess the TV's not gonna, or the fridge is not gonna show anything. 
How unfortunate. That's a paper over here? Looks like it. It's some kind of memo. Somebody named Oyama came here. When he asked if I'd seen anything suspicious, I told him he was to go fuck himself was the most suspicious person here. Mm-hmm. Not very surprising based off my experiences with Oyama. Oh, that's new. Bathrobe ghost, be wary. handprints over here. Sure, I can press it. Stairwell reveals a few things. I'll pick this up. They're coming for me as soon as uh, soon. They must be ravenous by now. If they catch me, then it's over. Places. There's a curse game in there, I can see that. Sniff, sniff, I smell the human. Sniff, 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 want raw flesh, delicious intestines. Obviously, want the curse cartridge, 15, I'll circle around there. Give me all your cursed video games, you're easy enough to avoid. Picked up hidden stairs key. Another hidden stairs key. Is this way to go. See, all is fine, all is good. Cross back over here. And out. Not much in there, nothing important here. That was my conclusion as well. I didn't want to check the areas back here, anyways. That's probably locked. Well, you never know about these things. So it's just being locked still. Oh, it's the fan. I wonder if there's a reason about that noise. I guess we can go to the next floor with the elevator key now. My guess. Oh, back in the elevator I go after I make sure this isn't open now. Ah, we're sure. Which means up to the next floor or wherever the hell we're going. Still locked. 701. So we'll try you. Oh, both doors are open. Time to touch it. Okay, a little bit deeper. see the memo and some other stuff. This is pretty straightforward. Just don't get caught by the ghost there. I'll read this note first. That was close. I didn't think they'd be lurking in such a place. Damn it. The wounds those demons gave me won't heal. I've got to be more cautious from now on. Yep. Picked up hidden stairs key. Very surprise. Guess we're ready to go to the next floor. I thought I had to go to room 702, but maybe I just misread or misremembered. To the next floor then. Here we 
it be. Not type of floor, right? Eh? Find the sign. There are ten floors, so we're probably making our way up higher. Probably floor zero will be the final one. Let's try the two doors. Of course, this one's open now. We can hear the game. over there. Obviously coming from behind that door. Let me press the ground here first. Nothing important in here? Yeah. These don't look like terrible hotel rooms or anything, so yeah. I, it's, like, it's just locked. I'll check out the game first. Game music? But it's locked. If only I had the key. Means we have to go towards the shower room that we're here in. I thought that was uh... a. Yeah. Of course, it's a toilet stained with blood. And there's something in the water. I think there's something under the surface, but I don't really want to stick my hand in there. I don't see a chain connected to the drain plug. <laughs> get this. Picked up Chris Cartridge 16. Another note here. Drain the water to the public bath, then a path will open. Well, that's convenient. Over here, there's one of those shaking books. I'll get the book first because it's gonna be another memory that might be nice to see. I just want to live normally, too. Like a normal girl with someone to di date on me. To date on you. After our journey is over, of course. That's the spire scene from earlier. Gah! Ah! Uh, yeah, we saw that scene in the other room as well. Oh, dote on. Okay, someone did You saved me. Hey, Rai Rai, what are you thinking? I. Sorry, never mind. We just got some other path, so. Just the beginning was different. Splitting. My ears are raining. I can't go on like this. I've got to take a chance and come out of hiding to fight back. I have the advantage. I'll ambush them in the dark and stab them in the heart with a knife. Then I'll bite into their neck. <laughs> I can't wait. Fresh meat. Ah, raw flesh. Meat dripping with blood. <laughs> wait for me. Stairs key. I don't know why I picked. Oh, I guess the other treasure chest just drained the water, so yeah. 
I'm guessing we can't just go back down? Didn't think so. Let's go up here then, to the next floor. Of course, now there's just a note here. Sure, I'll pick it up. A note? Hid NC stairs key in the basement cabinet. Uh, oh. Mm, blood right all over me. Look at that blood oozing to itself out. Okay. Go on to the next area then. There's a ghost in here. Is it bad? I'm curious what ghost was in here. It's open now. Game music? But it's locked. If only I had a key. Yeah, we don't have a key yet, do we? I never went in here, did I? That's locked, which means maybe something's still in here. Oh, we have to go back to the basement, right? Well, let's go on out. Yeah, I'm guessing to the basement we go. Everyone loves the basement. It's where all the kids hang out, all the cool kids, that is. If you don't hang out in the basement, you're not a cool kid. <laughs> okay, so let's check out 101. 801, that's probably locked. Not surprising. Basement time. Let's do it. Not alone here, so let's just be a little bit careful with the basement. Is it this cabinet? It's a cabinet with a double lock. I can't open unless I have two keys. What a challenge. white thing here. There's one of the keys. Got the cabinet key. This don't stand like that, please. This, this is not appropriate. Got the cabinet key. Now I can unlock the cabinet. Let's cross back over and see if we can make our escape over to the left. So open up the cabinet and then get out of there. That was gonna be a little more intense than that to be honest. And there's the key that we need. We got the emergency stairs key, which means let's get the fuck out of here. It's full right, we're gonna need to go to. Back to the eighth floor, which is because we're gonna now insert the key that we got. That we went so hard and far out of our way to obtain. That was pretty easy. Let's open this up now. Looks like the key I got in the basement will fit this lock. 
What a very picky key. That way it's blocked off, so I guess we'll continue upward. Take us to the emergency ninth floor. I feel weird knowing there was a hidden staircase in my closet and being in the 8th room, right? Room AO2 there. Let's open this up. Atta attached to a very fancy room, actually. Huh. I scan around with my eye. Well, I don't see any hidden things yet, so. Bone the bed. Hey, game, that was bullshit. <laughs> well, whatever. We try. I'm gonna start me inside the room or something. So basically, don't approach the puddle of blood, it will be the end of you. I'll try this door in the corner. Didn't think that didn't lock. Let's get out of here. Say about this painting? Oh, there was a thing there, I didn't even see it. I was <laughs> just clicking the painting. Oh, it's one of the curse game things, so we're gonna the end of this level. Curse game four. I fell for the last trap, I feel so dumb for falling for that. So you need to mash the button, it's supposed to hold in there or something. There we go. So this is nothing. That just sounds like a sound behind it, so... Yep, no good, the door won't open. This has to be this door. Another handy elevator. Not exactly what I expected to see here, but sure, I'll take it. Don't see anything else hidden here, so yeah, let's go. Probably to the top floor now. Disappeared. Let's find out. Oh, we're in a room. For some reason, this one in particular went to silent noise. Somebody from the toilet. Of course, nothing else much here. Nothing much to see in this either. Nothing important here. I will check out the which wa flushed toilet. This one's open. Before I press that, because I don't get a choice. This goes off to retry. Thanks for watching the video. I'd very much appreciate if you take a moment to consider donating to my Patreon, which I am using to try and make this more of a livelihood, not just for missed game videos, but little games to make my own time and to bring different types of videos to the channel. You can find the link for my Patreon in the description below, or in the 
video, obviously. If you'd be interested in seeing me recording gameplay videos and doing other things live, I stream quite regularly and record almost all my gameplay over a site called Hitbox TV on my channel. You can also see that in the video currently. Hope you enjoyed the video, and adieu.